It's a dark night, two and oh, so you, you, you see the beacon of light through that black hole. Greetings, signs, and moans, and of course, I have to welcome back all my stars. Any and all information that you need about me or regarding this reading shall be in the description box below. Let go. There's, there's, there's a sudden change happening, okay? Somebody's releasing something, maybe a negative energy. You may be going through some form of revelation, right? So we got a completion here. This may affect your 10th house, okay? Some of you, you're completing a cycle here, all right? Uh, you could be a Virgo, Cancer, maybe a Scorpio, all right? This is about your career or lack thereof. Somebody didn't complete something, all right? Um, something from the past, okay? There's some form of misconception surrounding some energy from the past. This is some form of injustice is what I'm picking up. Now, this could be like a divorce or somebody that's in distorted energy. This could be someone that claims to be a divine feminine, okay? So, let's see what happens here. Ah, uh, so, this could be like manipulation. I'm hearing manipulation of the crown chakra. So, this could be someone telling a story. There's some sort of a, uh, illusion here, okay? Or somebody doesn't realize why they do things. This could be like a broken partnership, Okay, this has something to do with your finances, maybe traveling. I'm here in the world. The world may see this. This could be something that's in public view. All right, people may be worried about the way they look, okay, or the way things appear. It could be some sort of illusion that was presented in the past, okay, that has somebody off focus. All right, there was some sort of uh, injustice that took place. You can show me what it is I need to see. Capricorn could be involved, okay. So somebody's trying to read your story, okay, or trying to dictate something, write themselves into your story. This could have something to do with your Akashic Records. You can show me what it is I need to see. So we got Law of Head Heru. We're talking about success, okay, or somebody that does not know what they're successful at. This is regarding your free will and some, some form of uh, change here. Somebody may have been trying to manipulate, again, your uh, your first house, Aries energy. This could be courage, okay? Or this could be like somebody that operates in a low, uh, very low vibration. That's what I'm picking up. Somebody didn't have all the knowledge, okay? And this could be you or this could be a third party is what I'm also getting. Somebody did not understand or understand their purpose here. You can show me what it is I need to see. Yeah, so somebody likes, somebody's not humble and somebody's not kind in this situation. There could be a priest that's involved or some sort of priesthood. You can show me what it is I need to see. On June. Is there somebody who's waiting for something? Somebody's name could be June. Somebody may be putting something on June. That could be somebody's name. Okay, so something took place on a Friday. Somebody was trying to read a story or somebody was telling a story. You can show me what it is I need to see. Okay. Something could be some something could have took place last Sunday or going forward. Somebody's going to do something, okay? This is somebody that feels like you don't have the courage to do something. Either show me what it is I need to see. Somebody's trying to see the unseen or something that is uh, hidden here. I feel like something's going to be revealed about this person. This is like a drama starter, okay? Uh, uh, for sure, this is happening in 3D. Red and green could be significant. Pink lipstick Lipstick could be significant. Or mauve is what I'm getting. So something took place at sunrise. Could it be early in the morning? It has something to do with bending of free will. Somebody didn't realize your purpose here. Or they didn't understand what they were doing. I feel like there was some sort of awakening here. Could it be a spiritual awakening? You may have gained some courage. Or somebody felt like uh, you weren't, you know, I don't know. Somebody felt like they could play you for a fool. Drama-wise is here. 
on July. Okay, in July or in April. April could be uh, someone's name. You can show me what it is I need to see. Okay. So, um, on Friday, somebody ran into some sort of obstacle here having to do with someone that they may have felt was a friend. Something was promised to someone, okay, and this promise couldn't be kept. This person was not able to see things clearly, okay? Uh, somebody's lights could have got shot off on Friday. Um, hold on. You can show me what it is I need to see. Puppeteer. So somebody was trying to pull somebody's strings or somebody was manipulating someone. Okay, this is something that was unseen. Somebody felt like they were going to profit something off of you or you felt like you were going to profit something off of somebody else. All right. So let's see. All right. So this has something to do with somebody's psychic abilities. Somebody wanting something to not to not be over. Okay. Somebody didn't realize something was over. Um, you're dealing with somebody that's superficial, somebody that's very ma materialistic here. Now, something was presented, okay, on a Friday. Or maybe something, somebody took something from someone on a Friday here. I feel like going forward, somebody's going to realize something, okay, maybe in the morning. At sunrise, why is this here? Psalms is significant. Maybe somebody's praying, okay, some sort of... Uh, so, some sort of repentance here. Melchizedek could be significant. Somebody's name could start with the M. Um, I'm picking up Melvin. Okay. Uh, somebody's dealing with somebody that's uh, ruthless in nature or by nature. This is somebody that has a dark spirit. I feel like somebody's going to be realizing something here. 75, 16 could be significant. The South could be significant. This is somebody that may have uh, passed up on you or they passed up on someone else or maybe they passed. You can show me what it is I need to see. Oh, baby. There could be a mother figure involved in this situation. All right, so in the past, either you or this person didn't realize what they were chosen for, okay? Somebody's chosen for chaos and uh, confusion. This is somebody that's in competition with you. Somebody's birthday could be in April, you know. Um, somebody awesome. Somebody may feel like they know your secrets or they're going to reveal something, but their secrets is going to be revealed. This person may attempt to say that you are into some form of sorcery, okay? But this is the individual that's doing the sorcery. I feel like they're watching somebody online, okay? It could be a mother figure. Somebody's attempting to call in a storm on somebody, and it's not going to work. It's not going to work for this person. Either show me what it is that I need to see. Oh, sacred geometry. Sacred geometry. This is about patterns. Okay. Somebody has escapism issues. This is also somebody that... I'm here in Tormal. Uh, Tormal? Okay. This is about somebody's gift. The eye of Horus could be significant or all-seeing eye. So this has something to do with money. Somebody needing to use their intuition. There could be a slow progression when it comes down to do with this. I'm here in Spider's Web. Somebody walked into a spider web? Literally. You can show me what it is I need to see. Okay, this is like distorted communication. Surrounding a contract or somebody's purpose. Okay, this could be about your career, you being at the crossroads. Somebody may feel their time is out. There could be like a timeless piece or somebody may be having something like um, handcrafted. 
handmade. Somebody thinks you get handmade uh, pieces here. So we got Venus, Taurus energy. Okay, somebody wants freedom from sort of, some sort of mental uh, conflict here. Five, five could be significant. Ten. Whatever was commun communicated about someone, I feel like it was returned or somebody was released. This could be like a divorce or something. Okay, or some uh, contract any. Why is the witch here? Yeah, this is about gossip. Okay, somebody's no longer able to gossip about you or you're not able to gossip about someone. So somebody's going to be delivering some news about you. Okay, you may, somebody, somebody's trying to work with somebody's ops to like present some sort of uh, obstacle or illusion here. Oh my goodness. A Taurus is significant, could be a Taurus moon and Capricorn as well. Like it's, it's a lot of uh, players involved in this situation. Somebody's trying to create like some sort of smoke and uh, an illusion. Okay. If you are experiencing any mental, physical, financial uh, health issues, okay, any strongholds, seek out the proper authorities. This reading is for entertainment purposes only. Somebody's, somebody's crying. Somebody's trying. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Somebody don't want you to trust your instincts here. They don't want you to see things clearly. And this is why they bippity boppity boo. So somebody uses the power of three or somebody did something three times. Okay. Oof. Um, there's something having to do with music. Something taking place at nighttime. Somebody's being haunted by something that they did. Uh, for some people, literally. Like, <laughs> yeah. This person may be, mm, this person may be crying here. Okay. Somebody's gaining clarity over something that somebody did some sort of illusion and maybe they um, dismiss this person yeah some somebody doesn't smell good their house don't smell good okay somebody's like oh i'm hearing borrow time why is uh air energy here if you show me what it is i need to see somebody dances around the issues uh, maybe they feel weak they try to bind you this has something to do with red tape like uh, paperwork or something like that this is a contract this is for some of you this is somebody that is uh, married or maybe this person feels like you are their divine counterpart okay skulls are significant here oh. somebody deals with the law Okay, so they may have went to the crossroads. Something was rejected. It's whoever they went to the crossroads with. It's like a, a spiritual gatekeeper. I mean, not with, to. Like, whoever they went for, they're a, a spiritual gatekeeper. May, may even be a law. Somebody's going to get caught up in their words. They're going to end up stuttering or something like that. But something is revealed, yeah. So somebody was leading their flock. Okay, and where they were leading their flock to is not a good place. Okay, so this is people that was under this person's instruction. This was a negative influence. This person was a negative influence to anybody that they communicated with. People may be realizing that this person tells a lot of stories and they gossip a lot. Somebody felt like they know they knew you. This is somebody that watches you or watches me. Birds, why is this here? This person may feel like you don't know that they're watching me. Or you think I don't know if you're watching me. Birds, why is this here? So this is about inheritance. So somebody's talking about some sort of gift or something that's manifesting here. Flowers could be significant as well. Somebody may be trying to order flowers. <laughs> Somebody thinks they're ordering from the same place I ordered mine from. And sex, why is this here? Mm. Yeah, so somebody's uh, 
dealing with the accursed, uh, accursed valley here. Okay, they may be trying to channel that energy, maybe even using a, a pendulum or something. Okay, I'm going to keep saying DOA. Mm, as they're doing this to a healer, they may be, this person is like sure um, that they channeled something correctly. For me, I know it's somebody that uh, maybe had been behind my, um, in my, behind my membership, right? And I showed them how to do something and you know so I know how it's playing out for me I'm not sure I'm not sure how it's playing out for you though okay somebody walked away you could be a musician okay but I'm hearing something about timing okay somebody's timing is off because they're dealing with the wise one okay this is like a, a collective of 12 or 13 uh, spiritual gatekeepers okay or spiritualists yeah so somebody has a strong defense some uh, defense system this person may not have realized that. The brawl, why is this here? Toilet paper could be significant. Somebody seeing you, somebody seeing you get toilet paper. Like you seen this person. And you thought it was something. Somebody thought it was something big. That's what it was. <laughs> something. Somebody who's full of, uh, you know, that stuff. Dong. So you was able to overcome this obstacle. I feel like you're not playing games with this person. This person may be realizing that. You're focused here. Are you, like, somebody even see something. Something that was in your way. The arch. <laughs> Why is this here? This person didn't know you had a security system. Yeah. Um. Somebody lets negative thoughts, negative patterns uh, overthrow them, okay? Uh, this person comes from a very hard, uh, they're like very, they come from a hurt heart space here. Somebody feels like they're channeling like, like spirits or something, but it's like saints. They're not the saints that you think. They're like shepherds, okay, for some of you. Uh, they're channeling your spiritual team, which would be elect ones if this is happening to you. But for some of you, this is something that you are witnessing. Okay. Um, on April Street. The sorceress, why is this here? Mother, mate, and crone are significant. It's three different people. Uh, somebody could be a palm reader, an astrologist, and maybe a tarot reader as well. Or you are. And this is happening to you. Okay, yeah, so somebody told a story. Um, a story. Okay. And the story wasn't right. <laughs> it wasn't legit. Okay. Somebody thought that they were getting a new beginning. Or somebody was going to offer them something for a story. And that's going to backfire. If something's going to be revealed about this person. And, and delivering, why is this here? Somebody's going to be coming towards somebody or something. This could be an ex of yours or this person. Or this, mm. Somebody's planning to tell a story. Um, right? Or they're not going to tell a story correctly. If they're like plagiarizing somebody's work. Okay, this could be a lot about the loss of love. Or maybe somebody saying that somebody does not have a partner, a spouse, or something like that. And people are gossiping about that. Why is the birds here? Yeah. So... You end the communication with this person, or you're going to. Somebody's moving on from like negative talk, negative people, um, being like a third party. Okay, escapism, or that's something that you need to, right? So somebody blames other people for their shortcomings. They feel like the world is the same way as theirs. It's because they have like a heavy heart here. This person was supposed to ascend. 
Okay, they, they may have even been doing good in the past or they had some sort of business plan that was going to be profitable for them. But when they ran up against this elect one and did that, it's not, ain't no, I'm here, ain't no sunshine when, when, when she gone. Type energy. Birds. Yeah, somebody's nosy. This person may listen to other people's conversation. I feel like I picked this up with where somebody's dealing with somebody that listens to, uh, listens to somebody's walls. This is somebody's like they project. Okay. They try to see who you're talking to or you're trying to see uh, who this person is talking to. Uh, for some of you, they're trying to catch like your significant other, other at your place. This person may have communicated that they wanted to put you in a, a compromising position. And the person that they were communicating to uh, is involved. Could be one of these signs. Somebody's a parent here. Okay, and this is about a gift that, like something that changed hands. It, it went to someone that it wasn't supposed to. And it something, whatever, you can't do this to the next one. Whatever exchanged hands and it didn't go to the right person, it's tainted. And somebody's going to realize that uh, going forward here. If somebody deals with the law, okay, are the, are the barons here. I feel like that's what's in somebody's house. Um, legacy, why is this? Ooh. Something's going to catch somebody off guard. This has something to do with um, you gaining clarity over something that was created or some sort of false accusation. Somebody could be missing teeth. Communic communication wise is here. Ooh. Well, um, uh, there's going to be a left one that somebody done. And it's not going to be something that you can see. Oh, my God. Okay, this is somebody's going to shed light. Or there's a light around somebody's door. Growth, why is this here? Somebody gonna be asking, why me? That's all I hear is why me. The shepherd, why is this here? This is nasty energy here. But somebody is like overconfident, they're egotistical. Okay. But they're also doubtful. Maybe this has this person has low self-worth or this is you because you can't manifest a partner. Uh, for some of you, somebody's messing with somebody's uh, husband. It could be somebody that worked for you or somebody that wanted to work with you. You may be going forward. You may be finding out that this person is cheating. Okay. This is somebody that wanted to work with you or wanted to advertise something uh, with you or for you. The sailor, why is this here? Yeah, so this person is, somebody has a lost love or somebody didn't heal. A sailor could be significant. Maybe somebody is in like some form of higher up, okay? Um, somebody could be going through some grieving process as well. This could have something to do with your family, some sort of manipulation, okay? This person may have been caught off guard is also what I'm getting. Somebody can't sleep. Because they're worried about something that was proposed. Okay, or somebody's trying to manifest a proposal here. And somebody's something's gonna get shot. Some so somebody's gonna be shocked. Okay. Somebody's trying to manipulate a proposal. Somebody wants someone to be heartbroken. And that energy is gonna return to whoever is watching that's in this negative space. Because somebody's is self-absorbed. Okay, they only think about themselves. Um, if this person is talking to you and you're involved in this, this person likes to love bomb you. But but they, it's like this person tells a lot of stories. If they're telling you that they love you, they don't love you. They got multiple people that they're doing this to you. To you. Ooh, two. The hunter, why is this here? Mm. 
engagement ring. So for some of you, this you may have married somebody in the past and you were in distorted energy. If you got somebody that want to work with you or wanted to like advertise something with you, this person is sleeping with or trying to manifest your partner. I feel like you're going to find that out. Something could have took place in, in the summer. The hunter wise is here. Somebody's a cat day. <laughs> yeah, you manifested this person when you were in a, a negative space. It could be a Taurus. This person could be a Taurus. Or you was just trying to manifest ability or somebody else was. Ethan, show me what it is. Uh, we, we've been getting that stubborn energy. It's chestnut checkers. Somebody needs to like surrender to their own creativity, and for them to do that, they gotta heal their they gotta heal their heart. Somebody's not gonna be able to if you're trying to become a business owner, right? And you're doing underhanded stuff, that energy is gonna come back. Like this is not the energy where you need to be trying to manipulate people. Because the God is putting people in your environment for a reason. And I feel like going forward, um, somebody's gonna realize that something is being reflected back on you or on this person. Okay, you're being guided to heal your heart. Stop being stubborn. Deuces. This is an individual that you may realize betrayed you in some sort of way. Somebody may come to you or want to come to you with an offer or some form of information here. This is somebody that participated in some form of betrayal. 